Deserving Dads Today is sponsored by NetJets, worldwide leader in private aviation. Do you guys mind if I just put my action figure? <laughs> I don't know Those if that's cool. suitable for morning television. <laughs> Bottom on that. Uh-huh. Uh, so with Father's Day on Sunday, Al Roker on the road surprising some deserving dads once again. Yeah, he hit a home run yesterday giving a Baltimore Orioles fan the gig of a lifetime. Today, a dad who's already celebrated so many milestones, it was almost impossible to surprise him. Let's go down to the Bahamas. Hi, Uncle Al. Hey, Al. Hey, guys, we're going to score a hole-in-one with this one. Uh, We've got another amazing dad. His name's Hartman Reed. His friends call him Hardy. He actually turns 88 today. He's packed a lot in those years. A Navy veteran from the Korean War, breaking color barriers during the Civil Rights Movement, a firefighter, uh, also a businessman, and still pursuing that love of golf while raising four kids, making him our deserving dad today. This looks like a special occasion for soon-to-be 88-year-old Hartman Reed of Arlington, Virginia. With all the hugging and singing Blackbird and doing a dance Hart calls the Rusty Dusty. It wasn't much of a dance. All, all it was is just shaking your booty. And just... <laughs> but Hart's family says they don't need a reason to celebrate him. They just do every single day. I think my dad is one in a million. He has such an amazing life, and he's so inspirational to us. I will agree that I have done a lot of of different things, but I thought it was just part of life. (laughs) And this incredible life began in a small town outside of Pittsburgh. Most everybody in the town were poor, and that was a fear that I've had over the years that I would never wanted to be poor again. And that fear turned into a fuel to provide a better life for his wife and four kids. First, joining the Navy in 1948, then four years later, in the early days of the Civil Rights Movement, becoming one of the first paid black firefighters in Arlington, Virginia. The feeling was that a black didn't have the courage to be a fireman, and we tried harder to do better And better he did, going on to become the first black station commander south of the Mason-Dixon line. I spent 27 years in the department, and I have to say that I loved that job. You learn to love helping people. Saving people by day and driving a taxi at night to make ends meet, eventually becoming a partner in one of the first African-American-owned taxi cab companies in Virginia, which he still runs to this day. I didn't know that the world thought my dad shouldn't be a firefighter or shouldn't own a cab company. It was always, whatever you want to do, do it. And that included caddying part-time at a segregated golf club, sneaking back in after dark to play around on the back nine with one ball and one club. We wouldn't want the superintendent or anybody to think that we were playing when we were out there if they caught us. Golf is still Hart's passion, but his true love is being a family man. My sister and I would always wait for him to come home from work, and he'd come in the house, and he'd open his arms wide, and he'd say, Popses, little girls! And we would jump from the top of the steps into his arms, and he never dropped us. And I think about that in terms of my life, where he says, go ahead and jump. Go ahead and do it. I'm with you. I got you. And on this day, Hardy Reed, we're coming for you. We're asking Hart to put his trust in us for the surprise of a lifetime. Hello, Hardy Reed. How are you, sir? Hello. Yes, sir. Hi. It looks like you've been with NBC about as long as I've been on Earth. <laughs> <laughs> I am an old man. Here's the deal. We want to celebrate you as a dad. Our friends at NetJets are going to put you all on a plane and we're flying to the Bahamas. Are you ready to do the Rusty Dusty in the Bahamas?
That's right, Hardy. Uh, happy birthday. As part of that, the folks at the Bahama Resort here at the Royal Blue Golf Club, this is Georgette, their golf pro. They've got a brand new set of clubs for you. Thank Georgette's you. Georgette's taking you out Thank on the you. course today. Great. Jack Nicholas designed this course. He has invited you uh, to, next week at the Creighton Invitational to be his guest. You will be with Jack Nicholas, your hero. Okay? And you didn't think we were going to get away without a birthday cake. We've got a birthday cake from the folks here at Bahama. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, a, it's a green cake. It's a beautiful. That, that golf ball's edible, actually. So we'll be eating for a while. And of course, we got the Valley Boys Junkanoo Band to play. Happy birthday for you, Hardy Reed. Hey, hit it, boys. <laughs> Good stuff. Yeah. Al, thanks so much. <laughs> Hello today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.